Hello students, this is Rajivatri. In this video, we will discuss some doubts related to our previous video. These three physical quantities are a very confusing physical quantities in the point of view of many students. So student, in this video, by some points, by some points of difference in between these three physical quantity, I wish to differentiate between these physical quantities and wish as you all were clear about these three physical quantities. So first is potential energy, second is potential and third is potential difference. Students, first of all, I take potential word. What does the potential word signifies? First of all, you have to know the meaning of potential word. What is the potential? You have the potential to crack exam. Yes or no? You have the potential to crack army physical. Yes or no? In similar pattern, the points into the electric field, into the region of electric field, have their own potential each point have their own potential for example point a has 60 volt potential for example point b has 60 volt potential each point have different potential as they are depend on distance by mathematical relation v is equal to q divided by 4 pi epsilon naught r these signifies that V is inversely proportional to R, that is, as R increases in the direction of electric field, potential decreases. So, point A has 60 volt potential, point B has 50 volt potential. Now, another quantity that named as physical quantity that named as potential energy. Now, you have the potential to crack the exam that is your potential but you sit into the exam and then actually crack this this is your energy potential energy for example another example I take a fan cooler AC the switches has the potential to run the fan but if I does not plugged in the fan into the switch, the fan does not run. The same phenomena act here. If the charge particle does not place at point A and at point B, potential energy is zero. Means potential energy is only the property of the charge particle potential energy if the charge particle is placed in the region of electric field then the charge a particle must exhibit potential energy if the charge particle is placed in the region of electric potentially electric field then it must have potential energy so potential energy is what now it is it is so if we define the potential energy, if we define the any type of energy term, we have to use work energy theorem that we have studied in 11th class. That if we have to find any type of energy, we have to do some work. So it is amount of energy required. Sorry. It is defined as amount of work done, amount of work done to move a test charge from infinity to given point, from infinity to given point. This is all about potential energy. Potential energy that is denoted by U as I have derived the relation 
for the same infinity to given point p it is overall work done to move a charge from infinity to given point p but if the energy difference between let us take an example that we have to displace the charge particle for from point b to point a if we have to displace the charge particle from point b to point a from point b to from point a the energy difference will be 10 joule we have to do a work of 10 joule for example if the work is done the work is done to move a charge particle from point b to a then it is equal to energy difference energy difference between final point to the initial point what we will do energy of final minus energy of initial point so students final point is a initial point is b and energy difference is 10 joule we have to do a work done of 10 joule to move a charge particle from b to a so at last we can write here Potential energy is only the property of charge particle. Potential energy, potential energy is only is property of is property of charge particle only. This is all about potential energy. Now, what is potential? As explained earlier, 60 joule, 50 joule are the energies by which a charge particle can be placed at these points. But as these points without any charge particle have the potential of 60 volt and 50 volt, these are their potentials. Randomly, I can explain either point A or either point B potential at single point potential at point a we can define as work done to move a charge from infinity to from infinity to given point a from infinity to given point a divided by charge divided by charge why the why we divide by charge because work done per unit charge is called potential and if the charge having some magnitude then work done per unit charge will also divided by magnitude of that charge for example q charge will have to do some work done w to move a charge from infinity to given point and for unit charge w infinity to given point a divided by q this is our potential so students same potential same same put, potential is at b work done infinity to point b divided by test charge this is the potential for point a and for point b in these two formulas by these two formulas what does we explain i explain i just explain that potential is a property only that location Potential is the property of only that particular location. Potential is the property property of location, particular location. And that location must into the region of electric field location into the region of electric field this is all about electric potential now potential difference what does it potential difference signifies potential difference kya hai potential difference hame kya samjhata hai potential difference as we have find difference in energy Similar pattern applied here. Difference in potential is called potential difference. Difference in potential 
in between two points is called potential difference simple or we can say that if we displace the charge particle from b to a if we displace the charge particle from b to a then ratio of work done to the test charge from b to a is called potential difference or we can say that work done to move a charge particle in between two point per unit charge is called potential difference mathematically potential difference can be given as for example let us consider we displace the charge particle from b to a the work done from b to a divided by the test charge if the test charge is of unit magnitude then only work done only w b the equal to potential difference potential difference final minus initial value final point is a initial point is b this is a potential difference from here also we can derive that term va minus vb after solving wba divided by q this will find out and this is potential difference so students we study potential energy and potential potential difference step by step in last conclusion we have understood that potential energy is a property of charge particle potential is a property of that location and potential difference is the difference in potential between that point so students still if you have any doubt then please put it on your comment section and if you like the video then please share like and subscribe thank you for watching